Many people find space a bit of a problem these days, but not so for a magician, because a magician can take something quite large from an object that's a lot smaller. I'll turn the bag inside out to show you that the bag is actually a very small bag, and yet we were able to take a full-size wand from it without any trouble at all. Now this you can do with someone perhaps that you don't like very well. If they stand still long enough, you can take the wand and push it right into their stomach. If they ask what you're doing, pretend you don't speak English. And as you withdraw the wand, make sure that you don't bring any vital organs with you. This is called the sticky wand, and with good reason, because if I grasp my wrist firmly like so, turn the hand over and open the fingers, the wand does actually stick to my hand. Now this has been around for quite some time, and you probably know the secret to this one, but if you're not familiar with it, it's worth learning just to have a bit of fun with. People come in different sizes, of course, and this is where the magic wand comes in very handy. If it's a real magic wand, you can take it by the ends and adjust the length of it to suit your stature. So if you're very small, you can make the wand very small, all quite adjustable so that you can have a very small wand or a very large wand, depending on how large or small you are. So there it is, a very versatile wand with many, many uses.